Hi friends, I am starting an experiment to grow 42 day tomatoes in Aero Garden Harvest. As the name implies, we should be able to harvest tomatoes in 42 days. Let's see how it works in Aero Garden Harvest, how real the 42 day mark is and whether it's worth growing in Aero Garden or not. Seed starting is very simple. Tomato seeds have pretty good germination rate. So I will place one seed in each pod and I will start with four pods. I will grow only two plants in this Aero Garden. If I get more than two seeds germinated, I will transfer the remaining plants to soil in my backyard. I am not adding any nutrition right away as germination doesn't require any nutrition. I will start adding the nutrition once I see the seedlings. This is what I usually follow with every new garden. Garden is ready now. Let's start the journey. It's day 11. I got all the seeds germinated. Looks like I added two seeds in one of the pods. Plants are thin and tall which is different from other tomato plants. I have grown red heirloom variety from Aero Garden, Tiny Tim Tomatoes and Red Robin Tomatoes. All those plants developed a very strong stem at this height. But these plants are coming super thin. Let's see how they do as they grow more. Day 27. Now the plants are growing really fast. Initial growth was slow and very boring. But they started picking up the growth since day 20. I also see the birds now. Excitement started. It's time to transfer the plants. As I said, I will keep two plants in this Aero Garden and move the remaining plants to my backyard. Day 38. I see lots of flowers on both plants now. These flowers are big and strong. I don't see any tomatoes yet. I see few flowers started drying up. Maybe some tomatoes are on the way. But there is no way I can get the tomato by day 42. Not even in 50 days. Maybe it needs a very specific atmosphere to produce tomatoes in 42 days. Anyways, plants are doing excellent. Let's continue watching it grow. Day 41. Lot more birds and flowers. Now I see a couple of baby tomatoes on both plants. So far so good, even though I am not going to harvest tomatoes on day 42. Day 45, plants reach to 1 feet tall. Tomatoes are getting big. They already reached the cherry tomato size. Somehow these plants are looking dull from the beginning. Leaves are looking pretty weak as they are not getting any food or water. But I don't see any issues with root system or pods. Maybe that's how these plants will grow. Day 60, I got few more tomatoes and the previous tomatoes getting big. I see lot of flowers are drying up and falling off now. Maybe the plants are taking a break from producing more tomatoes. Day 65, I still don't see any signs of ripening. All tomatoes stopped growing big. So I think they are preparing to ripe. These are the tomato plants I transplanted from the same Aero Garden. They settled well and producing lots of flowers all over the plant. I see bunch of tomatoes growing on these plants as well. None of them are ripening. Day 67. I see one tomato turning red. This is definitely not the first tomato, but the first tomato also slowly turning red. I don't see any new tomatoes coming. Maybe the plants are still waiting for these tomatoes to be ripened and harvested. Day 71. Few more tomatoes ripening now. Day 75. Tomatoes are ripening very well. First tomato just fell off. Not sure if I accidentally broke it or it just fully ripened and fell off. I also see bunch of baby tomatoes coming now. I was a bit disappointed earlier that it produced only 10 tomatoes. But now I feel better that it's producing second batch of tomatoes. This is the tomato that fell off. I am cutting it to show you the inside. Looks good. Very juicy with lots of seeds. It is still little bit of green. Let me check the taste now. 
Wow, taste is really good. Little bit of sour and a decent sweetness. And it has a classic tomato flavor. It's amazing. It is pretty similar to on the wine tomatoes that I buy from Costco or any other grocery store. Day 80, all the tomatoes from the first batch have ripened. Second batch of tomatoes are growing very nice. Plant has grown more than 1 feet. Some branches have reached to almost 2 feet, but they fell off and still growing under the lights. I am just picking few tomatoes from big and small sizes. Let's compare these with red heirloom tomatoes from Aero Garden. It's just a comparison. Size doesn't really matter. Taste and yield really matters. These are the plants in my backyard. I have many clusters of tomatoes all over the plants and lot of flowers too. This variety is doing excellent in both Aero Garden as well as in soil outside. Day 90, second crop of tomatoes are growing nice and big. Day 100, plants are doing great. Tomatoes from the second crop started ripening. Some branches growing long and they are nearly 2 feet, but majority of the plant is still under the lights. Day 103, tomatoes are ripening very well on both plants. Both plants producing many new tomatoes. Look at all these baby tomatoes. Day 105, 3 tomatoes ripened very well and I am harvesting these tomatoes now. Few more tomatoes are getting ready. These are the tomatoes I just harvested. I am placing a quarter for size comparison. Here is a cherry tomato I harvested from one of my other Aero Gardens. Again, just for comparison. These are the 42 day tomatoes I harvested from my backyard. These are also very similar to the ones grown in Aero Garden. It's day 115, more tomatoes ripened. It's harvesting time again. This one got a crack, but it looks fine. Oops, this is rotten. Here is the harvest. Tomatoes are looking beautiful. Some of them are super dark red. Day 120, I harvested all the tomatoes from the second crop. Now the third crop is getting ready. I am seeing about two dozen tomatoes from both plants together. And the plants are producing lot of new flowers. It's been 4 months and 1 week. Plants are doing fine but I see some tomatoes are getting rotten. Looks like the nutritional imbalance or the calcium or magnesium deficiency. To handle this problem, I am starting with cleaning the bowl and start over with fresh water. I think this will solve the problem. If not, I will start adding calcium and magnesium supplements. It's been four and a half months. Starting over with fresh water had a great impact. I don't see rotting issues anymore, so I don't need to add any supplements. Plants are looking much healthy. I see lot of new foliage. Plants are producing some new flowers. 
but I am getting into another problem now. This plant is growing even taller and spreading all over. I couldn't keep the plants under the light anymore. I am finally thinking of giving up on these plants. These plants did their best already. It's almost 5 months. Most of the tomatoes from third crop have ripened. I will harvest all the tomatoes including the green ones and give up on these plants now. Overall, I enjoyed growing this variety in Aero Garden. They are really fast and the yield is very decent. Taste of tomatoes is consistently good and very flavorful. Just for fun and to be accurate, I am calling it 80 day tomato instead of 42 day tomato. I will grow this variety again but I will try it in bounty model next time. All these green tomatoes ripened within a week after harvesting. Thanks for watching. Happy Aero Gardening.